Mr. Hunt, that these changes will have a positive effect. And in that, you're taking a massive gamble with people in the NHS. You're taking a massive gamble with people. I don't know why you won't address that point. What did you make of that? Well, it's a shame that uh, Mr Hunt refuses to speak to um, junior doctors like me who actually work on the front line. You know, we're doing this job day in, day out. We can see what the harms there will be in this new contract, were it to be imposed. And I think it's time someone sat down with him and addressed it. Now, M Mr Hunt won't sit down with the junior doctor. He won't sit down uh, and negotiate um, with the BMA. He's decided that he's going to impose a contract because he's written in his manifesto that there's going to be a seven-day NHS. And he's not providing any extra money for that seven-day NHS, so all we can see as junior doctors is that what's going to happen is he's going to stretch us over five, the five-day service over seven days, or make us work longer hours. Now, either of those is dangerous for patients. And so, as I said to him just then, in having absolutely no evidence base to um, base his change of this contract on, he's taking a gamble with people's lives. And that's why doctors like me are so angry. That's why doctors like me are so upset.